Hi coach, uh, off week here before you head to Big Tens uh, at the end of October. Talk about, especially, let's start with the women's team, where they stand at the moment and your thoughts on that. We're not, we haven't performed as well as as our training indicates that we should. Um, maybe that'll change, maybe that won't. But uh, the challenge that they have is at, at the Big Ten level right now, there's some there's, there's a cluster of pretty good teams in the Big Ten, but I don't think there's any team that's established themselves as the, as the clear favorite. Um, and even the clear favorite, if there was one, probably isn't one of those teams that's going to go stand on the trophy stand for the national championships. And so it's more about us making sure that we prepare to go to the Big Ten meet to be who we are, um, run at the level that we're trained and prepared to run, and, uh, and not be surprised at what that might get us. On the men's side, uh, you got the number seven team in the country. He's had some good uh, places so far this year. What, what's, what's your thoughts going into the championship season? The, the men's challenge is, is, is significant because the number two team, what we think might be the number one team in the country, Wisconsin, is the, is the clear favorite. And so to prepare to run a championship meet when somebody else is the clear favorite um, comes with its own set of challenges. Um, Minnesota's good. If we don't run well, Minnesota beats us too. But uh, it's my feeling that we're going to go in, we're going to run well, um, we're going to freshen up uh, enough and to, to, to represent ourselves well and, and hopefully uh, make sure it's an honest race and that Wisconsin has to work a little bit if, in fact, they end up beating us. And, and at the end of the day, what we know is they haven't done anything on the track that we haven't done. They actually haven't done anything on their course relative to times that we didn't do last year. Um, and so it's all about who's prepared to run the best on on that day. And it's, this isn't a mental thing, this is an emotional thing. All those things are important and they play into it. But you know, for our kids, it's, it's did their coach give them a chance to, to, to have have enough recovery, have their legs, be in a position where they can go out and, and perform, and, and do they have the ability to, to trust that and relax and go, go uh, take the very, very best shot at what is a really, really good team.